Welcome to Magic Gathering Strat, I'm Dan, and I need a standard video maker for this channel, but uh, we don't have a standard video maker yet. We have regular video makers for Pauper, Standard Pauper, Finance, and Theros uh, Block Limited, and Hearthstone, but we need one for Standard, so as long as we don't have that, I will be playing with my subpar decks. And here is my Mono Blue Devotion deck. Don't have the Cyclonic Rifts, don't have the Aces. And here we go. Love uh, the speed at which you get a match in uh, standard. Not the best hand, but we do have the mana we need. Uh, to get the Tasa and start scrying. That will make us happy. I'm gonna play Frostburn Weird on turn 2, unless something really weird happens. Should probably have Pithing Needle in the sideboard. Why didn't I put that in there? Let's do it right away. Over... Uh, a Negate and a Gainsay. Alright. Uh, play another land. Play the frostborn weird. Thassa Bident. Flint of Boar. No, that, that's not going to happen anymore. You have to say it, character is, but it does evolve the experiment one. Uh, well. I call upon the god of the sea, and she will turn on by the uh, Bident. It's actually in her hand there as well. But now he can play some giant monster. This purse seems really good here. Missing mortars on the Frostburn Weird would suck. That would really hurt. It's the Boon Satter. Uh, okay. 4 4 Experiment 1 attacking. I thought you like always bestow the Boon Satter, but of course he wanted attack here, but couldn't he just have bestowed it instead? Not sure. Well, I don't want the Bident. Now I do want to buy that, but the weird can't get through. Can the god get through? Or should we just disperse Judge's familiar play Biden next turn? Seems like a plan. Uh, Reverend Hunter, how big will he be? 5-5. Five, five. So we are dispersing the experiment 1. He comes in as a 5-5. Five, five. A 6-6 six, six even. A 7-7. Seven, seven. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. Oh, plus. Yeah, that's true. So now it can actually block the god. And we can't really trade here, so we have to take it again. But we can attack with Judge's Familiar, which does enable the god. Put that on the bottom. And I think it's time to play the Bident. And attack. Yes. Double Knight with Spectre seems like a way out. And now we have a god on defense. 
But it's very brittle, right? As soon as the frostman wheel dies. Wow. Okay. Giant Hydra. How big? 4-4. Four, four. Plus I cannot die. You don't have trample. Do I trade the weird? I probably do not. Uh, yep. We want that. We attack. So now do I want to make his creatures attack? And now I can. Certainly Raptor, Nightwell, Spectre. Do I have my stop set right? Set right? Yes I do. Now at the beginning of combat they will all attack. How much damage can I do? 4, 5, 10, 13. I can do 14. Uh, wow, they all have trample. But I don't have anything to do with my mana, so... Everybody has to attack. How much damage is this? Uh, 2, 6, 13, 16, 20 damage. I want to kill something. This guy has double strike. And he can get to 5-5. Five, five. So I have to block there. Uh, great blocks. There. How much damage is this? That tramples through, right? Wow. Horrible. I think Nalia will take care of this. Oh, he didn't pump. Uh, the Hydra. <laughs> so I live at two life. Uh, we want that. So we play a Night Vale Spectre. Uh, attack. But there is nothing we can find here, right? To save us. Well, let me know. Tell me the minute and second of the play and let me know what you would have done to survive there, but uh, I can't uh, do anything there. So, uh, countering creatures seems like a pretty good idea here. Uh, disperse wasn't too bad. Two Omen Speakers and Abidant, maybe. Master Waves is really good, isn't he? Something like that, not sure. See why I need a regular video maker? Okay, here I have the Master Waves. That's sweet. But I don't have five devotion. Oh, essence is scatter. Oh, interesting. But countering something turn two must be really good for me. Okay, so we didn't play anything, so we can move 
move on to playing Tassa for the scry. And find another land, play Frostbone Weird Essence Scatter. Or even Rapid Essence Scatter. Oh, Domri! That sucks. Near on the bottom. Rapid, rapid. Hmm. Well, the Master Waves will do a lot of damage here. As he dies. Oh, we can even play it. Yeah, that's one creature you don't want the rapid hybridization. Okay, so Master Ways for two. Yeah, we has, have to uh, do something about Domri, so. I think Essence Scatter doesn't fit very well in this deck. It's very hard to keep mana open. Oh my god. Okay, that's a rapid hybridization target if there ever was one. And he can fight now. Kill the Master Waves. Attack. But he doesn't. And now I have double Master Waves. No, oh, of course, it's he's not a legend. So how about that? Master Waves. And we'll attack... Domri with... These guys. And if he blocks with Hydra, we will wrap it. Yeah. And then it's not blocking. But Domri is alive and well, and now he will fight a Master Waves. No, he is going for the gold, but he won't have the gold. Nylea. He only has one green devotion on the table. And now he has three. Here's the hunter for four five five. Oh well, he had one himself. Well, hybridization is working. No, I don't want the land, but I do get the land. So we'll. Hybridisate, Reverend Hunter, and attack against Domri. We 
will he let his... Oh, Domri can't target because he needs to target the creature, so it's not the green ability. Wow, okay, and now I can counter the god. Mm, Master Waves working out. He has used his Domri. Here's something huge. Six mana. What is it? Miss Cutter Hydra. Can't be counted. <laughs> Oops. <laughs> Skilled. Can okay, it something to turn on the god? Protection from blue. Is this what I want? No. I don't want it. I don't want the land either. Uh, okay, let's take out Domri Ray then. Wow, skillful to counter the Mistcutter Hydra. So this is my third match with this deck. Okay, she's giving Trample and a plus ability. Come on, God! Judge is familiar. Four. I think I'm gonna take the edges familiar here. Swing for seven. And play it. Now I can block. Of course she has trample as well. Oh, that's ten damage, so uh, I died. If he has anything now, I'm dead. But I did randomly not die. He can pump two. Oh. Or can Rampager. So I need to win now. Night Wave. And swing with... It blocks the god. And I do 8 damage. That's not enough. Can I survive this somehow? Oh, I think I need to stay back with everything. To live through his attack here, and that even that will be very hard. Oh, he has protection from blue, of course. I can't live through the attack, and I'm just dead. But even if he didn't have protection from blue, I would be dead. If he has a green permanent. So the god can attack, and he does. So Miss Cutter Hydra works pretty well. I thought this was a really strong matchup for Mono Blue Devotion, but it doesn't seem that way. Uh, or maybe it's just my deck being crap and me being crap. Uh, anyway, let me know what you think about the deck and what you want me to change in it. As I said, I don't have the rifts, I don't have... Chase. Uh, if you look at a winning deck here, or oh, maybe even a winning deck from this daily, there is a 4 0 deck here somewhere. Here we are. 
And I'm not sure about the Nyctos either. There's two Rifts, two Jaces. Curse. Pretty nice. So instead of the two Rifts and the two Jaces, I have another Bident. With Disperse, a Fate Foretold, and Extra Rapid. Hybridization. Oh no, of course, Tidebind the Mage. I run three Omen Speakers instead. Leaving one card. 25 lands. Four Raptors for Weirds. Disperse Fate Foretold. Three Omen Speakers. Instead of Cyclonic Rift. Two Yaces. And four Tidebind the Mages. I have a main deck domestication as well. Maybe that should be the rapid. Hmm. Heck, let's do a bonus match. It was a faster red green deck, right? I didn't see any Polycranus or Stormbreath Dragons. So we do another match. Playing first. Of course, Time Mind Image must be a lot better than uh, Omen Speaker. Cowboy from Hell. Is there any other cheaper card that you would run over Omen Speaker? Oh, there is a Spectre gone from my hand. One more thoughts is, and I don't have much of a hand. I think I'm going for the Frostman Weird here. Even though I won't be able to pump it a lot. <laughs> I think he's playing Mono Black Devotion. And I'm just gonna swing for one and play the Night Whale Spectre. I'm sure the Night Whale Spectre is dead on impact. Ooh. Actually, now I'm just playing the Omen Speaker because I'm flooding. Oh, looking good. Do I want the Master Waves right away? No. So I'm putting that on top, that on top, and it's his turn. I think I'm going Spectre Master Waves. Uh, no, I'm going God Master Waves because I'm sure he has removal. Oh, he's connected to the Underworld. Of course, Night Will Spectre activates the god next turn. Hmm. Now, I am going for Thassa, the god of the sea. I think I'm just greedy if I'm playing... Actually, Master Waves is so bad against Mono Black. I have to go for the Spectre to beat down with Tassa. But just one removal spell and he stops me dead. He has six cards in his hand. <laughs> okay, well, now I don't have to wonder what I'm doing next turn. At least Tassa is giving us a, a devotion counter for the Master Waves. So we are taking the Master Waves. We are playing the Master Waves.
He figured out that he could block. And so he did. Okay, how many ways can Master Waves die in? Plenty of waves. Waves, not waves. He's drawing a card. Um, he's probably playing Desecration Demon. Another connections, but doesn't seem very good right now. Unless it's really flooded, he's gonna take a ton. Is it game? Now Tassa still is not awake. But he's gonna take some damage. Whoa! Okay, so we want Pithing Needle for uh, the rats. And Rapid Hybridizations for uh, huge dudes. Uh, essence Scatters, possibly. Uh, taking out... Disperse. Fate Foretold. Omen Speaker. Bident. Omen speaker. Back omen speaker. Disperse in. And we are going domestication for his uh, Nightwell Spectres, maybe? Or disperse for his demons. Essence scatter is not realistic, is it? I can see why you would play two Bidens. But Pithing Needle seems so random here. What if he doesn't draw a pack rat? Then it's just a dead card. Okay, I'm gonna play Judge's Million and then ride my SS Scatter to victory. It's a fantastic plan. He mulligan to six. Temple of Deceit in the house. Judge is familiar. Well, Frost from Weird seems pretty good now with the Master of Waves in hand. And the God. And he missed his land drop. So I am gonna attack and play. Uh, Frost from weird, but if I miss my third land drop now, then I am in trouble. But if I find my... Oh no! Why do people do that? I don't think it was definitely lost on his part. Well, now I've done it, let's just play a third match. I like this deck. I wonder how much better it would be with Jace and Cyclonic Rift. I've already seen the use of Cyclonic Rift. I'm not too impressed by Tidebind Image, but then again I haven't played it. I just bought it for 15 cents and sold it for two tickets. And that was my four Tidebind Images. Well, uh, familiar, weird. One one flyer that sometimes is a crappy days for spike. Your choice of bad card. 
scry. Okay, massive beatdown. And then I can even get an extra mana from Nyctos. No, I get one mana. Next time. But I can play the god. But I have three. So I really need four devotion before this turns into anything useful. But I can play a god, but I don't have a god. I am godless. So I have Disperse and Rapid. But there is the god. No, don't do it! Uh, well, devour flesh. Taza, go to the sea. Taza, 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 taza. Taza in Swedish means to pour around, to walk around silently on pause. Uh, by the way. I'm sure you really wanted to know that. Uh, yes, put on top, play it, play the Fident, and swing like in the theory book, but now the Frostbone Wheel dies and then there is no attack. No, we can both attack! Hooray! Oh, he has waited a while. <laughs> Um, okay, I really want to make this attack. Do I give up the god here? And draw into stuff? Or do I save the god? What a nasty choice. I am letting the god go. In order to draw the card. Not sure if that was the right call. Let me know what you think. Fate foretold. It's all very unreliable here. So I don't have a permanent. Yes, nice. So now I can play face for face face for two. Uh, no, I don't want to sacrifice a creature. I do want to play, let's see, play the fate, then I can't use it, so it's, it's really fate foretold. And disperse, hit for a card, get, draw two cards then. I do want the cards. Well... No, it's still fate foretold. Oh, it's still disperse. And a card. Master of stuff. And I can rapid hybrid the Desecration Demon as he comes down. Or not. Uh, so I get 5 mana from Nyctos here. Then I can play... Tassa. And Master Waves. For a large number of tokens, that looks a lot better than it is going to play out. 
But I got my extra card here. And I have double rapid on the defense. Cloudfin Raptor! He really needs to kill the Master Waves now, but I think he will. But then he won't be able to play the other guy. And I will still have Devotion. Blue, white, black, what do you call that? Is that a shard? Yes, it is the blue shard. Okay, yeah. Master Waves died, surprisingly. But will the, oh, the Frostbone Wave dies too? Scrying one. Finding Mr. Omen Speaker. So I can play Cloudfin Raptor. And Omen Speaker. Evolve it. Scry. Bottom. Bottom. Swing with Tassa. Draw a card. Uh, play the land. No, can't play it. And I'm done. Ready to rapid hybridisate any nasty thing that appears. Such as the Secretion Demon. Is my devotion count? Five. Perfect. So anything dies, and I have a lot of trouble. So, if he kills the Omen Speaker, do I hybrid it? I think I do, because that will evolve the Raptor as well, and enable me to do 5 damage. And give an extra creature. So yes, we are going to do that. Okay, now we have to... But now the rapid hybridization is even lethal. No, it's not lethal because he has the removal. And, and of course, Thassa will uh, be disabled if we do. Nice. Let's do that. Okay, what did we learn about black? A lot of his removal were... Instants. Hmm. Bident. Yeah, let's do this. Hellraiser. It's my opponent. Shout out to him. I'm gonna keep this sound. Don't want to move again. And I'm thought seized. My thoughts are seized. What a nice curve I suddenly had. He must have a Desecration Demon then. On the other hand... 
I have a bident. Unless he thought this is that too. Okay, I play my Frostburn Weird and start the beatdown party. Beatdown party commenced. I'm 1-1 one, one in matches, right? I'm not keeping track very well of standard things. So I need to win this and go 2-1 and my honor will be restored for all my mistakes. Temple of Deceit. Yeah, come on! Hellraiser. Raise some hell! We know, all know what you're going to play on turn 4, but we don't know what you're going to play now. Unless you don't have lands, but you do have the lands. Temple of Silence. And... Something nasty, it's Packrat! And Packrat is very nasty. Uh, Nightwail Spectre. Can they raise a pack rat? Depends on if I find the land now. But I can find his land as well. And I can't evolve with a Cloud Twin Raptor, so I'm not gonna play the Nightfall Spectre before uh, the attack if I don't draw land. So I can play the Biden instead. But I can play the Biden next turn anyway and play the Nightfall Spectre now, that's better. Yeah. So go ahead, Packrat! Packrat without Mutavolt is a little less powerful, isn't it? Wish... Uh, I want my... Pithing... Pithing Needle? Pithing Needle to appear, and so I can try it against Packrat. But now I feel like I am on the defensive here, that he will Packrat in... He will Packrat so much that I am in danger. All right. So now I do attack. He can make a pack rat, but that will not save him. But I can now pump as I didn't play anything. And he missed playing a land. So I can now find the land and take it. But I didn't. I took a gray merchant. That's not too bad. Let's take everything he has. What's in his hand? It looks really weird that he doesn't have a play. Uh, of course he's going for the pack rat thing. That seems too slow here, doesn't it? But it happens very quickly. Too quickly for me. I'm gonna play another standard deck uh, today as well. It's the Iset Insanity deck. I'm gonna podcast with Fedjukan uh, tomorrow. Night between Monday and uh, uh, Sunday and Monday. Uh, 03 a.m. my time. It will be awesome. It will be the first episode. Uh, okay, I can't really block here, so. And now we can make 3 3 rats. That's not impressive enough. Uh, and this Biden will be impressive. He can do 12 damage here. So 
So I will keep the... Oh, I shouldn't have played the land. Oh, I wanted to play the land. Yeah, I had to play the land. But I can play the cards I draw with Nightwell's Spectre later. All is yes. With yield. Uh, okay. Underworld connections. Land. 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 Life veins only. Okay, he's at three. He needs to stop my... He needs to stop two of my flyers. And he can't really do that, can he? I would be surprised. So he just need two removal spells and then... Does he win them? Ah. You need to make a pack right now to punch through the Frostmoon web, but I don't think he's going to, because then he dies. But I'm only winning this because he has, he has missed two land drops so far, and he seems to be missing a third one here. I hope you liked this extended play session with uh, Mono Blue Devotion. I haven't done this in standard ever. I do it in Pauper some of the time. Play sessions like this you could really stream. I'm looking for streamer too. I'm not only looking for standard video maker, I'm looking for streamer too. You can stream anything if you that is magic related, if you want to stream on our stream. We have subscribers, but we don't have a streamer. We have three streamers that do not stream. Including myself. I haven't streamed since the M14 beer experiment that it was not put on YouTube. I did stream tier one day in the Pope Gauntlet in August. Since then, very little streaming. I think my opponent is thinking really, really hard about how to beat my awesome machine, but he couldn't do it. Uh, thank you for watching. I hope you enjoyed this play session. Let me know if you want to see more Mono Blue Devotion. Uh, I intend to sell uh, uh, the Mythics during the spike. Uh, in uh, Under Night of Spectres in February, but uh, I could do more videos with this deck before then. Let me know what you think. Thank you for watching.